reports. New at 10, off-campus parties getting out of hand at a private student housing development tied to UCCS, and it is stirring up a reputation. News 5's Matt Pritchard joins us live tonight from the apartment complex, and how rowdy are we talking, Matt? Well, at least after talking with those living at the lodge off North Nevada, things apparently get pretty wild here on the weekends. Wild enough that even college students are asking for a change. How out of control can these parties really get? It depends how many passed out people there. <laughs> Party problems for UCCS students. The lodges, off-campus housing, opening their doors in August and making a fast impression. On the weekends, it can get pretty rowdy. It's an overall really nice place. You get to meet a lot of new people. Roommates are usually pretty cool. But it definitely can get pretty cool. Times. Springs police doing laps to the hot spot, responding 30 times in the last month, with calls ranging from noise complaints all the way to a sexual assault. And although nothing came of that, residents telling me things definitely need to change. I park pretty far away, so I don't get beer poured on my car anymore. Beer bottles in the stairwells, puke in the hallways. It's a little too out of control, and it needs to be brought down a little bit. So management's making the adjustment, reminding everyone of the party rules, such as holding to one noise complaint per party and keeping it to just 25 people or have it shut down. But they're also willing to listen and try to find out what will keep these weekend bashes under control. We, we want to fix those issues. We'd love to hear about them, you know, more so we, we can uh, handle them in the best, best way possible and, and make them feel comfortable and um, not have those reservations. Even with the issues, students say they really like living at the lodges. They just like to see a change happen in the party protocol. Since then, the parties have calmed down. They're still pretty bad, but... Not nearly as bad as they were the first two weekends. With everything new, there's always going to be some new standards and things change a little bit. So I'm assuming that things are going to get better, you know. It just, it'll take time. Now, guys, I spoke with UCCS about the issues that are happening over at the lodge. They said they're aware of it. Problem is, this is the risk you run when you live off campus. Another interesting stat for you. We mentioned there that the lodge has had 30 police calls in the last month. Well, so is UCCS except that's the entire campus as a whole. In Colorado Springs, Matt Pritchard, News 5 Investigates. Matt, thank you as always. We will